This is Franciscan Media's Saint of the Day for July 31st. Today we celebrate St. Ignatius of Loyola. The founder of the Society of Jesus was on his way to military fame and fortune when a cannonball shattered his leg. Because there were no books of romance on hand during his convalescence, Ignatius read A Life of Christ and Lives of the Saints, thus beginning his long, difficult turning to Christ. After reporting a vision of Mary, he made a pilgrimage to her shrine at Montserrat, remaining nearby for almost a year. During this period of conversion, Ignatius began to write down material that later became his greatest work, the spiritual exercises. In 1534, at age 43, Ignatius and six others vowed to live in poverty and chastity. Ignatius was elected to serve as the first general of the new society. Obedience was to be the prominent virtue to assure the effectiveness and mobility of his men. All activity was to be guided by a true love of the church and unconditional obedience to the Holy Father. A true mystic, Ignatius centered his spiritual life on the Trinity, Christ, and the Eucharist. He died in 1556 and was canonized in 1622. There's more about the saints along with inspiration and Catholic resources at our website, saintoftheday.org. From Franciscan Media, this has been Saint of the Day.